How is it going everybody? You're watching that about tag and today I'm going to show you the correct way to clean your AirPods and I have here with me the AirPods Pro and also the regular AirPods. So I got you covered on the models and by correct way, I also mean the safe way. So if you follow me, if you follow what I'm showing you, there will be no risks of damaging your AirPods. So it's super important to make this very, very clear. This is the safe way to do it, how Apple recommends you to do it. And also, I'm not gonna use any fancy tools or anything like that or any products or anything. The whole idea of this video is that you can follow me and you can do this as well with the products that you have in your house. So as you can see right here, I just have water, I also have here a regular toothbrush, cotton swabs, and a microfiber cloth. So, as I said, products that you have at home, you don't need to buy anything, you don't need to buy any fancy tools or anything like that. The idea here is that everyone can do it. So, the first thing that we have to do is actually to grab the AirPods and then uh, separate the AirPods from the case. Okay, this is super important. So, take out the AirPods, put them right here, with, um, if we're talking about the AirPods Pro, remove them as well. And we're gonna talk about the tips in a second if we're talking about AirPods Pro. So then it's very important to separate case from AirPods themselves. To clean the case, and we're gonna start with the case, we're not gonna use water. The water will just be necessary for the tips on the AirPods Pro. So all of the cleaning right here will be done with a microfiber cloth, cotton swabs, and the toothbrush, all right? So, all you have to do is open it up, and then, as you can see, there's a ton of dirt right here, especially on the AirPods Pro. Take a look at this. This is really, really bad, as you guys can see right here. And all you have to do, all you have to use, is just the microfiber cloth. So, prefer to use it because it's gonna clean it much, much better. If we have uh, complicated play spaces right here to clean it, we're gonna use the other, uh, the other objects, but let's try and begin with the microfiber cloth. So all you have to do is just clean it. And of course, I'm gonna go ahead and give it a good clean. I'm gonna speed up the process, clean it, but uh, you see that all that I'm using is the microfiber cloth and I'm cleaning the whole thing. So cleaning it and cleaning it, cleaning the whole thing. And as you guys can see right here, take a look at this. After just a few seconds, it's pretty much pristine. Take a look at this. It's pretty much perfect. Awesome, right? So, as you guys can see right here, let's keep on cleaning. And then the top part and everything. Uh, keep in mind that it shouldn't apply too much force if you don't want to break your AirPods case. They're tough. They take some beating, they won't break so easily, but uh, don't do it too much, don't pull the cord too much, because otherwise you may actually break it, all right? But you can apply some force, as you can see, I am applying some force, and you can go ahead and clean it, and take a look at this, with just a few seconds of cleaning, it's pretty much perfect. Take a look at this, guys. So, I absolutely love this. Of course, if the microfiber cloth wasn't enough, um, what I would use is the cotton swab to get on the corners right here. So try and get the corners. The cotton swab is great for those corners right here. So uh, just go ahead and keep on cleaning. Keep on cleaning, keep on cleaning. And as you guys can see, it gets pretty dirty already, the cotton swab, as you guys can see right there. And then you can also use the cotton swab, and let me get the focus right, to go ahead and insert here inside, as you guys can see, I'm inserting, I'm not applying too much force, I'm just inserting to clean all the components, to clean uh, the magnets that, that lay here at the bottom, so I'm just cleaning them gently, not too much force, just a little bit, but as you can see as well, a lot of dirt here on the cotton swab, right there on the connector, so pretty dirty as well, and then it's already pretty much perfect, guys, take a look at this. So with just a few seconds, inside the lid, the top lid, the inside of the lid, and everything looks pretty much perfect. Let's do the exact same thing here on the regular AirPods. So as you guys can see right there, it's pretty dirty as well. So let me zoom in a little bit. It's pretty dirty as well. So not, too, not looking really good. 
And what I'm gonna do is the exact same thing. As you can see, pretty much perfect, pretty much 100% clean, just with the dry cotton swabs and with the dry microfiber cloth, okay? Now, and then uh, this is probably the most important, the AirPods themselves. So let's start with the regular AirPods right here. They're already not dirty, not super dirty, but as you can see here at the bottom, for example, a little bit dirty here and there. So what I recommend you to do is just to get a microfiber cloth, as usual, put them here inside and then give them a little a good clean. So that's what we're gonna do. Scrubbing and scrubbing and doing that. Microfiber cloths are amazing, guys. You have no idea how good those things are for cleaning uh, products as a whole. They are great. And as you guys can see, just after a few seconds, that thing is gone, completely gone on this side and completely gone on this side as well. So absolutely perfect, nothing to worry here. Same thing with the regular AirPods. So as you guys can see, pretty dirty as well. But in this case, since we have the tips, my recommendation is to first remove the tips. So give it a good push and then it goes out, comes out. Same thing with the other side, push and it comes out. And then we're gonna clean the AirPods just like that with the microfiber cloth. So clean, 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 keep cleaning, keep on cleaning, and then put them on the table. A little bit of special care right here on this side. So then after this, look at them, shiny, 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 looking excellent, perfect, nothing at all here and there, perfect, absolutely perfect. And now last but not least, we have the tips. And those tips are pretty yellow, if you ask me. I feel like they're really yellow. So uh, on the back part, you can see it's much more white. And on the front part is yellowish. And that's because of dirt and your wax and all that. And I know that's gross, but we have to be real here. And this is the only part of the air ponds that you can actually soak it in water. So you can use water to go ahead and submerge a little bit, as you guys can see. So submerge because there are no electronics here or anything. This is just a filter and uh, uh, this is just silicon and all that. So you shouldn't worry about anything here. And again, all of this information comes from Apple support from their website. And they say you can actually uh, put water in, you can soak it in water. So then after this, you can use our little friend, the microfiber cloth to give them, whoops, to give them a good clean and to get them really dry, all right? And then you're gonna do this. You can squeeze them, no problem, it won't break. So you can squeeze them and clean it and squeeze and clean. And then you're gonna remove all of that excess of dirt, earwax and everything like that. Just keep on cleaning, keep on pulling all of that uh, nasty stuff, all right? And then, as you can see right here, whoops, it gets better. It won't go away 100%, so it's still a little bit yellowish, as you can see, but it definitely looks better than before, and that's actually all you can do. If it doesn't get 100% white, you shouldn't worry too much, because it's still good, it's still perfect, and if you want it to look really white, you should buy a new one because Apple will sell those tips. You can buy a new one, but you shouldn't worry too much about uh, putting any products here or maybe putting bleach or anything like that. Don't do that. You just damage the thing. The, the best you can do is a little bit of water and scrubbing, all right? After that, you can go ahead, now that it's super dry, and uh, you can actually flip fit them in, so push them in, perfect. The other side as well, push them in, and then, there you go, it clicks in, and then there you have it, perfect. You can put them inside, and you are good to go. Same thing here with the regular AirPods. They're 90% clean, but my AirPods Pro, take a look at this. Brilliant, right? Looking good, looking great, looking pristine. There you have it. So, 
that's it guys that's literally it uh, that's the correct the safe way and the easy way to clean your airpods you don't need, you don't need fancy tools you can't use you shouldn't use any type of products or chemicals that's how to actually clean them a little bit of some cotton swabs uh, toothbrush that I didn't even have to use and of course the most important the microfiber cloth and a little bit of water for the airpods pro tips that's it so if you enjoyed the video please make sure to hit the like button down below on top of that hit the comment box and the little bell icon and last but not least also make sure to hit your comment down below and let me know what you thought about the video as a whole so that's it and i'll see you on my next video as usual bye bye